If y'all know about T9, I just put you on. That nigga's hard. It's T9. I-N-E. That's how you spell his name or whatever. Look him up on Spotify, Apple Music, all that. Yeah, he hard. But, what's good, YouTube? I just wanted to make a little vlog today, you feel me? I wanted to show y'all what I'm up to. Ugh. I cleaned my room a couple minutes ago. You can see, like, the, the little, little vacuum lines and stuff. I never really organized my shoes enough. I know that's an issue. And I didn't make the bed, because when I get home, I'm going to jump right in the bed. But yeah, the floor is clean. Cause before I cleaned it, it was real bad. I'm not gonna cap. There was clothes everywhere, stuff on the bed. But yeah, today's just gonna be a vlog of what I'm gonna do. It's already late. It's like four o'clock. I'm about to go door dashing. Make a little money. Hopefully make like a hundred and something dollars. And then I'm going straight to the gym. It's leg day. I got this stuff in this Urban Outfitters bag. It's my gym stuff. Let me show y'all. Show y'all what's up in here. You feel me? It's a little shorts or whatever. Gym shorts and it's just a regular black t-shirt. I'm not going full them, but just put it back in the bag. Goodness. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, let me go out to the car. Get my keys. I don't know where they are. Need my wallet. Let me just show y'all what I'm looking like. I'm not looking too good. I need to cut real bad, bro. It's actually quite tragic. Gotta hit up my boy Dexter. That's my barber. Let him know I'm, I'm lacking real bad. Occasionally. He said, don't put you in the vlog. All right, everybody. This is my mom. She's enjoying her. What is this? Tea? Coffee? Chocolate? Hot chocolate? He told me not to put her in the vlog. So you know I had to. <laughs> I had to put her in the vlog fast. You feel me? But yeah, I'm about to hit the streets. I'm going to the gym later, so I'm gonna wear the Crocs. I always wear Crocs to the gym. It's real comfortable. But yeah, that's the whip I'm I'm riding in right now. If y'all don't know my situation, I'll explain it in a later video. But something happened to my Corolla. Y'all heard the way that started up, bro. Not gonna lie, this car is not stable. In the slightest bit. I be feeling like it's gonna leave me stranded somewhere. But shoot. I don't know why, like, it's on auto focus and auto everything, but it just be making me mad dark sometimes. I don't know if it's like, you know, configurated for my type of skin or not. If you picking up what I'm putting down. God damn, she bad. I'm in my neighborhood. People just be walking sometimes, bro. And I just seen a real bad John Walker. But like, I be so embarrassed driving in this car to ever holler at anybody, so it is what it is. I'm just do what I'm doing with my day. <laughs> hey, yeah, babe. On to the first day. Let me, I ain't even got my, my stuff set. You lying, bro. I left my phone in, in the crib. No way. I gotta go back to the house. All right, y'all. Went back to the crib. Got my phone. Now we get continue on with our day. It's so crazy. I think it's because I was holding my camera. I'm always holding my phone. So I just forgot that my phone wasn't in my hand or something. But, uh, yeah. I'll let y'all know when something interesting happens. Bye-bye. <laughs>
I like those when I ride around. Buying no money, but buying I'm off these drugs and I can't lie, I think I'm worth on your love. Copyrighted. But um life is so good when you just smile, like forget all your problems, everything you've gone through, bro. If you just smile, I said turn it down. I'm not trying to get copyrighted. I, I swear life is so good when you just smile, bro. Like you forget your problems, forget everything. You woke up today. If you healthy, you're healthy. Like, even if you're not healthy, you probably gonna get healthy. We're humans, we heal, we get better, we grow, we elevate. It's good positive energy out here, man. You just gotta embrace it. Be positive. Come on, man. Let's attack our day. It's already way, way, way too late to be uh, making too much money off of DoorDash today. It's 4.15. So I'm gonna set myself a goal. Matter of fact, I'm not gonna set a money goal. I'm gonna just set a time goal. I'm gonna go till 10 o'clock. So that's six hours. And at 10 o'clock, I gotta go to the gym because the gym closes at 11. So, yeah. Back in. Yeah, yeah. Man, I'm Sid and I love you, Herbo. Got his name for Swerve and Press the Wheel. You know that I you call him Swervo. <laughs> uh, I be rapping all the time, like, man, I'm Sid and I love you, Herbo. Got his name from Swerve and Crash the Wheel. You know that's why they call him Swervo. That shit was hard. But let me think of something else. Let me let the beat inspire me, yo. Uh, 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 uh. uh. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, riding inside of the whip. It's a Nissan Altima. I'm the ultimate. He's the Don, the D O N, the O N E, the one. I swear he's like really him. Like H I M. My nigga, you know I'ma win. W I N. My nigga, you know I begin. <laughs> I start going in a little bit. I'm out of practice, but I swear I, I really be like thinking shit off the dome. And I be going crazy sometimes. I'm going to catch a good time where I'm freestyling. Especially when I'm high, bro. The gangster story, gangster. Alright, y'all. I just made it to the mall. It's like the central DoorDash capital. All the orders be coming through here. So I'm just going to wait at this parking lot. Or in this parking lot until I get a little order order. I already got a couple of them, but uh, it was some bull crap, so I didn't accept those. One was like ten dollars, but like it was five miles and it was two orders. I wasn't doing two orders for ten dollars, bro. You're gonna have to give me more than that. And then the other was like five dollars, so we we wasn't accepting those. Uh, I just got this order. The mileage is crazy. The mileage, 10 miles for $12 is crazy. But it's all highway miles, so I think I'm going to accept it. Let's go to Chili's. I already know how to get there. I don't know why I clicked that. Anyways, I'm about to hop. Hot this motherfucker. People be looking at you like whenever you got this camera, bro. I swear, everybody in their mama staring. Mind your business. But I think the, um... The trick is to just not care. Just pull it out, use it, and not care what they gotta say about it. That's not what he said, hopefully. <laughs> like I said, I need a cut, but like, today's Thursday. If I get a cut today, I guarantee you I'm not gonna wanna make money tomorrow. I'm gonna be looking too cute, and I, I'm gonna be want, I'm gonna be wanting to have fun. So I'm taking that sacrifice. I'm not getting my cut today. I might get it tomorrow. If not tomorrow, I'll get it on Saturday. But I just know I gotta work tomorrow, so. I'm making a conscious decision. You gotta stay ugly. Stay down till you come up. I just picked up the, the chilies. It's right here. But yeah, buckle it up. I always buckle up the food so I don't like fall when I'm driving. Safety first. Not for me though, I never put my seatbelt on. But I always bump up the food. <laughs> Shows your priorities, my guy. So I've been meaning to make like a dedicated gym video because the other day I weighed myself in and I was 130 pounds. 
and usually I'm like 140. So that means I lost 10 pounds and I ain't never have any fat on me. So it had to be like 10 pounds of muscle from not eating and not working out and stuff. And that was like a week ago. And after I saw that, then a coworker at Amazon, I'll be working Amazon nights, night shifts. A coworker was saying that I was skinny and stuff. I ain't never been skinny, boy. Except when I was like in grade school. But after my sophomore year of high school, I got big yoked up and stuff. You can't see it under the hoodie, but I'm really like, I'm like that type shit. But yeah, after I saw I lost 10 pounds, plus my coworker called me skinny, bro. I've been hitting the gym, eating like nobody's business. Like, I feel like I already gained five good pounds, bro. And it's only been like a week. I definitely did gain at least five pounds from water. But I don't know like how much of that is actually gonna stick. It's gonna take a couple weeks to get that weight back. But yeah, I've been wanting to make like dedicated gym videos to show my progress and stuff. I think I will. We just gotta wait on it. I love music. I'm pulling up to the house. By deliberate. I'm not about to. Uh, I rate every time that I deliver an order, but I just thought I'd do it for like the first one, maybe the first couple. But yeah, this day house right here. <laughs> Let me not uh, put their personal business out there. Imagine they walk out and be like, yo, why you calling with my house, man? Why you call my house, man? Yo, tell me why I walked in there. Oh, I had a huge dog. A huge I'm talking about a sandlot sized dog except it was brown looked like a, a cane Corsa and as soon as I knocked on the door the uh, dog was right like inside of the, it was a glass screen door and you can see the dog on the inside but it said hand to me that's what the order said so I had to hand it to him so I had to knock on the door as soon as I knock on the door the uh, dog bounced up started barking and I pushed the screen door because you know a lot of times you could just pushing from the uh, inside and they open so I pushed it from the outside made sure the door don't break the dog don't break through <laughs> cuz I ain't trying to die boy you never know what people's dogs is gonna be on bro but yeah that was a little interesting little thing that happened bro there was this other time it was probably like two years ago I was door dashing and somebody's big old dog jumped out the door started chasing me bro I'm talking about really chasing me. I took off and dropped the food, bro. <laughs> I dropped the food and took off. And the dog was chasing me for a good 45 seconds. I took off on his ass, though. He couldn't catch me. But yeah, that was scary, bro. I just got another order for Chick-fil-A. And it's like $8 and like five miles or something. So I'm about to go pick it up. The only problem is it's 4.7 miles and it's $8. That would be cool, but it's sending me into the city, into Wilmington. So like, in the city, a mile could take you a good five minutes, which is crazy. I just hope I didn't get screwed over. Let's see when we can go. It's looking like I got an opening. After this GMC truck, nope. Hmm. Whole lot of whips. Whole lot of people is coming. And I be feeling like I'm really stupid. Like I really feel like a dummy. Bitch looking bad and I'm thinking I liking her. I put this dick in her tummy. Where I be fucking and having her dad, she lay in the bed like a mummy. Uh, I'm tough. <laughs> Y'all hear that ooh sound? I gotta fix the wheel bearing in this car. I don't know if I'm gonna record that too, but definitely gotta, gotta do that if y'all don't know i work on my own car so like when stuff breaks i just order the parts and i fix it because i'm not about to be dealing with mechanics bro i hate mechanics for a lot of reasons number one they'll have your car and they, they just gotta fix something simple on it they'll take your car for months not fix what you need to be fixed and then give you excuses talking about Oh, yeah, man, it's going to be done next week. Whole time, you don't have a car right now because it's in the shop. Like, literally, you give your car to somebody and they don't give it back to you for months. And they charge you hella, hella bread to do what you need to get done. They always overcharge people. Like, 
It's crazy. Mechanics wild. I suggest that everybody just learn how to work on their own car, man. Especially if you are a man. I'm not saying women can't do it, because I encourage that too. Y'all women take power. Cause a lot of times like people try to take advantage of women and um in mechanic shops they try to think that the women don't know anything and they start charging you for bull crap. It's really crazy this world we live in, man, but Y'all get educated, learn how to work on your own vehicle, especially for regular maintenance. Like, you shouldn't be taking your car anywhere to get the oil changed, bro. It takes me 10 minutes to change my oil at home. 10 minutes, you just gotta take off one bolt, let the oil drain out, put it back on, and then put the oil back in. That's the Chick-fil-A we're pulling up to. Maybe this. is. Right. Swear up through the hell. You know you a pussy, you will never be my bro. Look at this nigga. I'm finna hit ya if you're not careful. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Ah, shit. Huh. People really do be staring when you got your camera out, bro. Every time I'm doing something, they just, I, I just see all these eyes on me. Just got the Chick-fil-A. But I swear I keep having these weird interactions, bro. Cause why did I go in there? And the people that's working, he's right in front of the counter. I look straight at him. I'm about to say, yo, do you have my order, blah, blah, blah. He starts talking to somebody else that's behind me. And then he goes to doing something in the back. Just treat me like chop little, like I'm not even there. And then another boy that was walking up, I made eye contact with him. And he could tell that I'm a little annoyed that the boy didn't help me type stuff. And then I tell him who I'm picking up for. And then he picks the order up. It's on the table. He picks the order up. And it stares at the name for like 45 seconds, bro. Oh, you really got to check it over that that long? And then he asked me to confirm it. Like I'm about to steal their food. I don't know what's going on. First the dog, now this. I'm going to stay positive, though. It's a good day. <laughs> so, the time is now. It's 6.44. I don't know if it's backwards for y'all. 6.45 now. And I did like two more orders. And it's really been dry. I got $35 so far. But I came to this uh, other parking lot that has a couple stores on it. That usually hit for some change, but it ain't hit for like 15 minutes. So now I'm about to go somewhere else. But yeah, I've been listening to Louis Armstrong. Sometimes, you know, you just gotta put, put the, the oldies on. Like this was made before I was born, but like, you feel me? Still can enjoy it. If y'all don't know, I'm the world champion whistler. Like, listen, I just gotta find the beat. Um, I got another order. This one's for like ten dollars from this like Chinese place called Rice. It always smells so good in there. 
and I've never eaten it before. And I love Chinese food, so one day I want to try that, John. Low key, low key, want to try food. Speaking of trying food, I want to start doing like food reviews, like official food reviews type stuff. There's a lot of food places in Delaware, but not a lot of them are good. So I'd have to be like traveling to different places and stuff, trying to find like the best food spots. I love food so much. And since I work out, it don't really matter what I eat, I'm always gonna look good type stuff. So yeah, y'all let me know if you want me to try different foods. And I'm a person like, I literally don't dislike any food. Like I, I understand why they're all here. I eat anything, bro. And I like most things. There's not a lot of stuff I, in this world that I really don't like. So it's like, you feel me? I try anything for real. I tried, uh, what's it called? I tried clams. Like raw clams, like straight out the fresh clams, bro. I did that with this one girl. She put me on low key. Kind of, kind of miss her. I ain't gonna cap. I'm gonna hit her up this summer after I get my new car. I'm, I'm virgin so far off topic but yeah i'll really try anything really try anything for real. all right ladies and gentlemen a lot of time has gone by it is now if this thing will work it's 909 <laughs> that's a handsome guy right there man it's 909 and it's getting close to the time where i'm gonna go to the gym so i got like maybe two more orders i'm gonna do i'm at 96 dollars See I'm in 96 and I'm about to do one for eight and then I might do another one and then I'm gonna go to the gym so I'll probably next clip I'll probably show y'all me at the gym as y'all can see I just landed my dash made 111 it took a little bit like five hours but you know gotta do what you gotta do sometimes to make I know you can't see me at all I'm not even gonna try to show you me but yeah you gotta do what you gotta do to make your bread man Alright, I'm about to head to the gym. Alright, y'all. <coughs> if you don't know, I go to the Edge Fitness. Just pull it up. I think my bro Schneider's why I know he's in here. Because that's his car right there. So, we're going to look up with him. See what he doing. What he up to. Things of that nature. Dang, why am I so close? Let me pop I feel so at home when I'm in the gym, man. What are you looking at, man? Yo. Mind your business. Yo. <laughs> yeah, it's time to yeah, go, bro. I'm posting that. I'm posting that. That was some wild shit. That, that nigga's so funny, bro. That's so funny. Look at this nigga, bro. <laughs> Cornball, yeah. <laughs> I got this drum light. Are you a YouTuber now? Yeah, trying. Welcome to my. Right. I got a Beamer. Oh, for real? Yeah, it's outside. That's tough. Are you I gotta check two right now? Huh? Are you leaving two right now? Nah, nah I, I just got here. Oh, me too. Yeah, I'm about yeah. to I got legs today. Ooh, good luck. Yeah. I'm a I worked out legs with her yesterday. She likes upper body. That's why she likes upper body more, though. You're competing on it's, it's very, very quick. He's about to record me doing some dumb shit. I can't, I'm about to say I can't see shit. This is gonna be more for dumb shit. Dumb ass shit, you man. I'm really an athlete for real. Not an athlete. I'm an athlete for real. All right, let me go and kill my legs real quick. This boy gotta go to work. All right, my boy. Catch me. I'm gonna catch you. I just got my brake rotors. We replacing rotors? Yeah, because I, I hate the rotors. But I need to order the pads though, so. Pads? Probably in like the next like month. Low key? Month and a half. Or half a month. You getting like uh, performance pads? Yeah. So, I was gonna say, I always get my pass from uh, AutoZone because you can get them forever. Lifetime warranty. Yeah. And if you get the best ones, you can just keep replacing them with the best ones. Yeah. 
That's what I did for the Corolla. Oh, I'm not the key. I didn't get the roller. I didn't get the basket. But yeah. Alright, wait, wait, wait. wait. Let me go and kill my legs now. And the dreaded uh, motherfucking bench press. It's already set to five. That's why I always, I always be on number five. You me? so sad because like usually when I was into this gym stuff I'd be hitting three plates easily on the second set I'd be doing three or four sets on the second set I hit 315 third set I add on to that but we gonna get back to it I'll bet trust me I'll trust and believe we'll, we'll get back to it We got it done. That's what I'm at. I'm gonna wreck this, wreck this thing back up. As you can see by that crowd of people, they hit the legs machines that I wanted to use. So on leg days, I do shoulders as well. So I'm just gonna do a, a shoulder workout. I just left whatever weight was on here, and it was two plates. Shit was kind of hefty. We got it done. But on the other side, there was an extra 25 on there, and I felt it when I lifted it up the first time. I was like, hold on, what's this? <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna just do three sets of this, and then I'm gonna try to go back to those leg machines. See what's up with that. 
Y'all like that transition? I'm on our Casey Nice that stuff. But I'm um, ending it here. Unfortunately, my camera died. And this is like a 30 minute video. I, I just got done editing it. And ah, uh, yes, it's a little long. It's a little lengthy. I already know nobody watches my channel. So nobody sat through this video. <laughs> but just by the chance that you watched it, I appreciate you. And yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Hope y'all enjoyed. Like the video if you liked the video. And yeah, I'm going to see y'all later. Bye.